Hello viewers, have a good day. Welcome to another tutorial. Today, we'll learn how to download Landsat latest 9 satellite or 8 satellite image from USGS Arctic Cruiser. So, for download, uh, open any web browser and write Arc Explosor dot usgs dot gov okay then search it so this kind of interface you will see in your uh, desktop so the first thing is that i want to describe everything those who are beginner to download the lancer cellular image from usgs search criteria this, uh, then data set additional criteria and result there is a four layer of setting to download our Landsat satellite image. So first one is the search criteria. Here you can see that in the enter search criteria there is a two way. One is geocoder and there is KLM or shape file upload. That means you can download a selected geocoding method. That means feature you can uh, directly type any area or place name and you can search that place. On the other end if you have any KML file or shape file by the using of this KML or shapefile, you can also download the your uh, study area or whatever you want to download. So I will, it is very easy to uh, go with geocoder. So the second step is select a geocoding method. So you should select feature or path and row. So basically we select the features. Okay. Then there is a third step is US feature and wall features. If you are belong to belong from the US, then you should select this one. Or you your uh, hometown is uh, beyond the US state, you should select uh, the wall features and type the name. I uh, want to type my uh, local area. Okay, and during the type your local area should uh, remember that the spelling should be accurate. So uh, this is the features name my local area, but you can also select your country, okay, from here, or you can directly go, okay. Then feature class feature types not necessary to uh, select this one. You can directly click here show, okay. At first try to find out your uh, the area. If the feature name uh, already connected with the USGS, you can easily found yes. So my the local area already searched by the USGS, okay. And the populated place India already downloaded also given here, okay. Then you can come here polygon circle and predefined area. You can select the your area to the help of polygon circle or predefined area, okay. But I want to go with the uh, as usual. Then the second is uh, option is. Uh, if you go below this is very important a uh, data range crowd coverage and result output okay so data range if you want to i actually want to show you the from uh, the, the total extended year how many year want to download i want to download only last year data so i just go to 2024 and select uh, the date that means uh, in which period or which date you require data you can just select here so i want to uh, download my local area data only for the last year so i select after august to august okay so this last year i want to uh, search my data so range data this and second one is important cloud coverage if you select 100 percent cloud coverage that means all the data which captured by the land site uh, sorry, landslide, landslide, all data will appear in front of you. I want to just want to show you, uh, for example, then go to uh, data set. Now, it is the second step. You can see such criteria already, all the criteria already put uh, step by step. Now, data set. Here, it is important. I want to download landslide. So, check image, okay. So, select this landslide. Now various landsets and light variance is here, but you just select this landset collection to level 2. Uh, there is a two set of data, landset collection to level 1 and landset collection to level 2. I want to mention you that landset to collection uh, landset collection to level 1 is not radiometric, sorry, atmospheric character data. 
but level 2 and collection 2 data is atmospheric corrected data that means ready to use you can use this data directly that is why you should select the Landsat uh, 2 uh, collection to level 2 but uh, Landsat uh, collection to level 2 data actually provided from 2020 okay uh, if you go before then you should select the Landsat uh, collection to level 1 but you should do the atmospheric correction before your work okay then go to uh, result section so this is the last uh, section uh, it will take uh, some time uh, to search your area and find the result okay so you can see here uh, result already came so you can see here there is a number of satellite image in front of you if I uh, select first one what you can see you can see that key most of the area is cloud cover okay here I want to mention you that uh, during the selection or during the when you want to download your data you should think about the uh, weather condition of your particular area the seasonal weather if your area has summer in uh, you should think about summer and winter in your area okay uh, if your area if uh, the you want to data during the summer you should think about the cloud coverage on the other end you want if you want to download winter data you should think about the fogginess okay so that is very important so on the basis of your uh, on the seasonal variation in your area you should download your data it is very uh, important uh, or suitable period to download your data uh, you can say the after the summer or before the winter okay so during that time you will get uh, more visible data that means less cloud or uh, less uh, fogginess so if you you can see here this is a data of 2025 month of uh, uh, july but uh, this is our india and you know that it is a monsoon country so during this month of june july august the summer actually going on so most of the area of this covered with the heavy cloud so we can't get any information uh, most of the information is invisible here so it is not suitable for the land use land cover or other activity similarly if i go and check this and i check it uh, month of june date also it is also uh, will show the similar kind of uh, scenario you can see most of the area is cloud covered so i will go okay this is a month of may data so here also I have some areas of cloud coverage i will not go so it is take time consuming okay to search it so that is why i should go i actually want to show another thing just go to search criteria here you can see our cloud coverage okay so i actually want to select those uh, landsat image if that image has the cloud coverage less than 10 percent okay I want to select only those satellite images which have the less than 10% cloud coverage. Actually, if I select this criteria, you will get the more precise landsat image as well as it is also less time consuming activity. Okay, so cloud coverage range less than 10%, then click on result. So now you can see the most of the uh, images which actually come here less cloud coverage. So, first one is you can see here the month of march i click it and you can see this is the cloud less okay less cloud then less than 10 percent cloud coverage data actually you can see here this is month of uh, march this is also month of march this is month third march this is 19th march okay and this is february okay so i want to select uh, similarly you can check it so here also month of november data also here month of December it also here so it is very suitable to take uh, your land use land cover map I should select month of November or month of March for this area okay 
Now the second important thing is that how to download this. You can see that the fourth one is the show fingerprint, then show the overview, then show the metadata, and the last one is the login to download. So if you want to download this uh, land use data, uh, land set data, you should log in. So you should you should have a user ID and password. It is very easy to create user ID and password. Okay, you, you can just click here, create new account, and give the uh, username and password, and go one by one step, and you can easily to your user uh, USGS user ID and password. You can get after getting user ID and password, you can uh, log in here, and uh, you can do download the uh, land use land cover map. Okay, so now. Just wait, go to result, okay, so this is my uh, study area, I want to download this uh, Lancer image, now you can see here uh, the, uh, the download uh, icon activated, I just click here, so loading a download option. Now you can see here add all files to bulk. Okay, download all files now. Select file. There is a two type of uh, series there. So one is level two surface reflecting bands, a level two surface temperature bands. So there is a two type of uh, uh, the band is there. Okay. Not only that, you can see here there is a total eleven band. Okay, so. Uh, individual band data you can also download so it is better to click here okay then set collection to label to product okay click here so uh, the total files is about uh, 8 8 mb so download started and it will take a uh, time so after download this uh, metadata i will show you how to uh, use this lens data in your study area.